Hi guys, it's Justine. Welcome to my channel and Happy New Year's! Today is December 31st. It's New Year's Eve and I am about to go out to dinner. So I actually look put together for a video for once. Um, today I'm going to be doing my December favorites video and I don't really have a lot of favorites for this month because I did travel to New Mexico so mostly the stuff that I've been using while I've been here are like things that I use all the time, my staple items, things that I just can't travel without. So I'm just going to get started really quick. This should be a pretty short video, so yeah! So my first favorite for this month is this tiny little wallet. This is just like a no-name brand wallet, a cheap like $3 wallet from Amazon. It shipped from China, it was like took like a month to come in. Um, I basically wanted a really tiny wallet to put in this purse because my normal wallet doesn't fit and this has actually been really great for travel because when I go out to like a store or something this fits in my pocket, it fits in like my hoodie pocket, it fits in my back pocket, not really in my front pockets because like if you're a girl and you wear jeans you know how much front pocket jeans suck for girls but this is my favorite. It says Forever your friend, your choice. I honestly don't even know what that means, but I got it because it matched this purse. So yeah, that's my first favorite for this month. My next favorite for this month is the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer. I love this. This is honestly like my perfect shade of bronzer. It smells so good. It's very, it's like super blendable. I'm wearing it today. I'm also wearing a little bit of like a Tarte bronzer today because the tart bronzer has a shimmer and this is matte. I love this. It smells like chocolate because it's the Too Faced chocolate. They use like the, I think they just use cocoa powder, but yeah, so that's another favorite. Just very, very simple favorites this month. And then next is the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara and again, I love this. I just have the sample size of both of these because I did, I reviewed them in the Too Faced Better Beauty Blogger, whatever it was called. Um, this brush is amazing. It gets all of your lashes. It makes your lashes like not clump together at all, which is probably, like that never really bothers me a ton with mascara because like I have pretty thick eyelashes. So if they clump together, like it's not a huge deal for me because I have a bunch of other eyelashes. But this makes my eyelashes look so full and... Love it. It's another favorite. And once this runs out, I'm definitely rebuying a full size. And full sizes are so expensive. $21 for a full size. But I love it. And I, I think it's definitely worth the money. Okay, another favorite is this Vaseline Lip Therapy Rosy Lips. Looks like this. It's basically just like a pinky, um, smells like roses. And it's like a tinted Vaseline for your lips. I love this. This has been like my savior for this season because it's been so dry here. My lips are so dry. Like I already have like naturally dry lips all year round, but like this winter they've been like cracked and bleeding and just disgusting and awful and painful. And this has been amazing. It makes my lips feel so soft. It does have like that sticky Vaseline texture and it does get all over your fingers and like it like makes your lips sticky and is kind of uncomfortable at first, but like oh my gosh, it makes your lips so soft when it's off. And so there's that. Next, another favorite, and of course I just have the sample size, and I'm debating on whether or not purchasing the full size, but it's the Benefit Cosmetics, the Pore Professional Pro Balm to minimize the appearance of, of pores. I basically use this as like, like to prep my face before I put makeup on, and I use it before my primer, but honestly you could probably use this as just a primer, but lately I've been using this, leaving it on for a few minutes, letting my face soak it up, and then I put primer on, but you could just use this as a primer itself. It is a little tinted, but like, oh my gosh, the full-size tube of this is not that big, and it's like $34 for a full-size tube, and so that's ridiculous, and so like, I love this, but I honestly don't think it's worth like $32, so I probably, I love it, but I probably won't be repurchasing it. Um, another favorite is, oops, there's like hair in this, but whatever, um, are these detangling brushes. I had one of these a while ago. I loved it. I lost it. I don't know what happened to it. And then I found this one at the Dollar Tree. And so I love this. This, it like, it brushes your hair without tugging on it. Like, um, it's a lot healthier for your hair than a normal brush would be. Like, you're supposed to, I'm, I want to do a whole video on, like, how to keep your hair healthy, and you're not supposed to use normal brushes on your hair. You're supposed to comb your hair because it's healthier, but, uh, this works really great. It doesn't tug on your hair like a normal brush does, and it's, like, healthier for your hair like a comb, and it has, like, these 
soft, like very flexible bristles. I don't know if you can see and my hair's in there, so sorry for the grossness. But anyways, this was a Dollar Tree, so like only a dollar for this. And like if you get it on Amazon, I think it's like $10. So anyways, um, if you watched my New Year's Eve makeup look, you know I was having a hard time with the e.l.f. Dramatic Lashes. So I also got this at the Dollar Tree, and these are Sassy Chic Eyelashes. Um, they look like this. They're the pair that I'm wearing today, and I love these. These look so natural. They're so comfortable on your eyelashes, and like, they're... Here, let me take them out of the box so you can see better. They come with glue, because a lot of like cheap eyelashes that are only a dollar don't come with glue. Which is one reason that I have been buying e.l.f. eyelashes for so long, because they do come with glue. Anyways, they look like this. They're really full for, like, Dollar Tree eyelashes, but they're not very long, but, but, like, that doesn't bother me a whole lot. Like, I like the shape of them, personally, but I feel like a lot of people would go for a much longer, more dramatic eyelash. And, like I said, it comes with a little thing of glue. Not sure how well this glue works, because... I've been using my next favorite, which is the Ardell Lash Grip Eyelash Adhesive. Um, I was using the Duo Lash Glue for a while, but I had the black tinted one, and like, I hate that one. I mean, that's a whole other story, but like, I get black stuff everywhere. I'm sure my, my New Year's Eve makeup look was such a mess because like, my eyelashes weren't working, my eyelash glue was a mess, my eyeliner was a mess, but I put it up anyways because I figured, you know, it would like, be inspiration for makeup inspiration for other people but um yeah anyways so I went and got this Ardell Lash Grip Eyelash Adhesive it is stinky it does have like a um like not a great scent to it but it works really well it's very comfortable and I personally this is the first time I've used the Ardell Lash Glue and I th I like it better than the Duo Lash Glue, but maybe that's just because, like, I haven't used my clear Duo Lash Glue in a long time. I've just been using the black one, and I, I hate that one. So, yep, that is my other favorite. And my last two favorites I do not have with me because they're my sister's, but I will enter pictures of them here. My sister hid them from me because I kept borrowing them from her, but really, like... If she didn't notice they were gone, let's be honest, I would have taken them home with me. Anyways, the first one was the Formula 10.0.6, and it's like this matte face lotion. And oh my gosh, when I get home, I'm going to buy this because it just makes your face feel so smooth. It makes it feel so matte. It's like a, it's like it's a lotion, but it doesn't make your face feel greasy. And it kind of almost makes it feel like tight. Um... But, oh my gosh, I just, I love it so much. I was stealing it so often. Like, every time I did my makeup, I was stealing it from her. And I think I used it in one of my tutorials um, to prep my face. But, oh, I love it. And I'm definitely buying it when I get back home. And the second is the um, Bath & Body Works Twisted Peppermint Body Cream. And, like, I, that was also my sister's, and I jacked it from her. And, like, oh, it, when you put it on, it, like, makes your face skin feel like tingly and it gives it like a cooling sensation and I wanted to buy some for myself but like last time I went in the store they were all gone and so I'll have to wait for next year to get that unless I go on like eBay or something but I'll probably just wait till next year to get that so yeah that is it for my favorites for this month it was a busy month because I was traveling so much and I was finishing off the quarter for school and yeah so I really don't have a lot of favorites so sorry guys but that is my favorites for this month and so yeah thanks for watching um, my social media will be linked down below I have uh, Twitter and Instagram and please like comment subscribe etc share this video with your friends and yeah that is it thanks for watching and happy new year